वेरी गुड आफ्टरनून एंड वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल दिस इज सोनल साइनिंग इन वी ऑल हैव एक्सपेक्टेशन वी आर ह्यूमन बींग्स एंड वी हैव आर विशेज आर डिजायर्स वी हैव आर थॉट्स एंड एवरीथिंग ट्रांसेंट इन टू बिकमिंग एन एक्सपेक्टेशन विच इज द मोस्ट नेचुरल वे टू एक्सिस्ट एक्चुअली सो देन वेर इज द प्रॉब्लम बिकॉज इफ यू लुक अराउंड most of the conflicts and the hurt and the disappointments are actually caused by expectations if only we could get past expectations i think there would be peace all around us so if expectations are the most natural way to exist but expectation still causes so much conflict then what is the problem and where is the problem well the problem is not so much in having expectations as it is about attaching yourself to those expectations attaching yourself to the outcomes of those expectations because then you are setting yourself up for hurt and disappointment because you are putting your happiness into somebody else's response to those expectations and that's where the problem is so let's see how to deal with those expectations to be completely honest the most uh, appropriate answer to that question is detach yourself from that expectation but i know that it is not one of the most practical solutions although it's the best way it's not the most practical way because let's face it most of us are not in that space where we can detach ourselves from attaching ourselves to that expectation because if we reach there then we probably would not even have expectations so let's look at how practically we can deal with these expectations so that we don't find ourselves in the middle of uh, unique feeling uh, stressed or hurt so one of the ways is you can uh, you know categorize your expectations into three different categories one is your need the, uh, second is your want and then the red flags so your needs are those expectations which you think are are needed uh, for a for a healthy and a balanced uh, relationship one thing that we need to ensure while putting our needs our expectations in the need category is, is as to where we are coming from because it's extremely important to come from our alignment when we are actually uh, listing our needs and not from our egoistic self because when we come out of that space there again we are blurring the boundary between our needs and wants and you will know you when you sit quietly with yourself you will know the difference between your need and your want so list them according to your priorities needs are you have to have wants are the that negotiable space which is nice to have good to have you know icing on the cake but if you have to let go of certain things then you must not disappoint yourself so so want are those expectations and then there are red flags which definitely need conflict resolution and a, a whole different conversation to have so for today we will just deal with our daily expectations and how to deal with them so one is to uh, you know prioritize them second is to do some amount of self reflection and uh, figure out whether you have unrealistic expectations or whether people around you have unrealistic expectations of you because in either case it's not the most healthy space to exist now what are unrealistic expectations so let's focus on some of uh, those so for the longest time in my own life and i have actually learned it the hard way I grew up with this whole fantasy in my head uh, you know I romanticized this idea of somebody looking at me and understanding what I'm going through uh somebody uh, you know looking in my eyes or somebody knowing exactly what I need let's get this straight no one no one can read your mind no one can read your mind you yourself cannot read your mind because mind is such a fluctuating space to exist that a lot of times you know it is shifting and you cannot get hold of your own self let alone somebody else so let's get this romantic idea out the window no one can read your mind yes and there are a lot of people whose eqs are very high and they might be able to empathize with your situation to the extent that they can but still you no one can read your mind so let's communicate so when you are standing in a space where you think that this this particular expectation falls in the category of the need you must communicate that 
to whoever that expectation is or whoever is expecting that out of you the second uh, thing is we also grow up with this expectation that somebody else can make you feel whole uh, you know this whole concept of yin and yang masculine energy and feminine energy makes us believe that there is this other half of of, of ourselves that you know who can complete ourselves who can complete the wholeness that that we need to feel inside this again is a huge misconception those energies do exist but uh, they, they have got nothing to do with making yourself feel whole because you are the only person who can actually make yourself feel completely together and completely one and together whole in which case when somebody else comes into your life he, he or she or they they will only enhance your experience of life they will only enhance your experience that you share with them rather than you having that expectation that they're coming to full to to make you feel whole uh, somehow the the third expectation that we have all grown that a lot of us have grown up uh, into is that somebody can completely take care of our needs because when we are growing up uh, you know we have this we know that there are um, our moms or our caretakers are there to take care of ourselves and you know the, the subconsciously uh, whenever we whenever we needed that care when we were growing up when we couldn't talk we seek their attention and we knew that that attention gave us what we wanted and a lot of people actually live that that that, that whole expectation actually lives inside in, in 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 a way that when they grow up and when they feel that their expectations are not being met they start seeking attention uh, and you know that's a very toxic toxic space to start coexisting uh, because then you know you're putting unrealistic expectations on somebody else you're get, getting the attention and you're coming out of a complete disalignment of your own self so it is not possible for anybody else to completely take care of yourself again it goes back to your prioritizing and having that healthy com- uh, communication with whoever uh, you know you have these expectations with and come to a balance uh, as to what works in 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 every situation and taking a call from that particular space so uh, i hope uh, i uh, you know i i made myself uh, i hope it resonates with you uh, somewhere uh, please let me know what you think and leave a comment you know how to get in touch with me uh, send me a message and uh, please do a thumbs up if you like the the video and like share and subscribe and spread the word around guys because you don't know you know what clicks with uh, whom till next time this is sonal signing off see you soon bye bye